Hello and welcome back for our level 14 episode of Red's Redemption. We are here in the 12 in the quest mired in kobolds. Blink and you've missed it, which obviously you did. I'm a bit disappointed to be honest because we, uh, as you can see here from all these wonderful chests we've opened, we decided on the spur of the moment to take on the big dragon at the end. And we did very nicely against it. Uh, Nas made a very decent job of holding its attention. It only slipped uh, once or twice. And Red just sat on his backside in the corner, letting the archer's focus stacks build up to 25. And he was hitting it very decently between the, uh, the sniper shot, the many shot, throwing in the devastating shot. And, and yeah, we, we have a half-decent um, crit profile anyway, even though it's only a level 7 bow. 16 to 20 times 4 is not too shabby. So, uh, all in all, we kept chugging the haste potions and we took her down very handily, didn't we? So I'm, mm -hmm. I'm a bit sorry. Uh, we wanted to share that little bit. We're a bit sorry we didn't have that one recorded. Maybe it will be for another time. But... Uh, a little uh, feather in the cap, perhaps. So, level 14. We have the arrival of some new spells, a new level 1 spell, so I took uh, the helpful resist energies, so I've got all those on the bar now. It's doubly helpful because at the moment Nas doesn't have those or, or doesn't uh, see the need for them, so I, I'll be doing those at the start if we need to. In uh, fairness, I have them, I just don't cast them. <laughs> no, you don't like them. <laughs> yeah, okay. Um, and what was the other one? Oh yeah, the new level 4 spell, the first level 4 spell. Now, I probably would have gone freedom of movement uh, were I on my own, but NASA's obviously got that covered already. So I've gone with the uh, Cure Critical Wounds, which scales up to level 20. So I've now got Cure Critical and Cure Serious as my two things I can throw at our cleric. Now, I did find that um, during the dragon fight when she would go down, I mean, she's quite capable of healing herself anyway, but I did try throwing the odd bottle, and it really does, it's not like you can quicken them or anything like that. Accelerate just uh, accelerates the movement of the bottle to the target, not the very slow wind-up, which uh, you might remember if you saw any of the Alchemist uh, series, those bottled boosts, if you did them without quicken, it was like took forever to just wind up and, and, and engage the thing. And same for these. They're just a little bit, uh, there you go, look, a little bit. So while ever I was doing that, I wasn't firing on the target. So it's a bit of a, a choice you've got to make. And uh, I'm sure I'll make the wrong choice more often than not. But it's nice to have them. And the AOE we've already seen, even with just the two of us, is quite nice. So I'm not complaining, and as we as we go up in level towards 20, I'm sure that Cure Critical will start doing, uh, what is it, at the moment it's on about 200. I'm sure it'll go up with better gear and all that. Hopefully, maybe we could, what could we shoot for at the cap? I think there there is a positive spell power on the on the gear. I think it's on the, the weapon, the bow he'll use. Maybe we could shoot for around 500 healing from it. I don't think that's... I think you're doing about 400 now, aren't you all? So maybe 500 isn't too overly optimistic. Yeah, depending on which one I use, yeah. Yeah. Um, so, what else have we got to share? Enhancements, just uh, pottering away in the... That's your phrase, isn't it? Pottering or No, just, just putzing. Putzing around. <laughs> Um, building back up in the horizon tree, I don't plan to, uh, in fact, I'm saying I don't plan, I honestly don't know where I'm going to go with all this, um, I plan to at least go as far as getting the, the no step mist back again, and then maybe I will leave it there, oh, and the, the thing, that third core definitely for the, um, extra mark, benefits i'm sure the even the lesser mark uh minus 10 fort i'm sure even that helped us against the dragon we just faced but after that i mean we do have the choice of going all the way to 20 plus in here 
fourth core and uh, scatter shot and perhaps this plus two attack and damage with long bows, bows and short bows but um, I'm going to want at least 11 in here for the third core, the double shot and the haste boost. Um, something like 7 in here perhaps for those two sneak attack dice and the imbue which we're going to want to uh, to get going on. Uh, where does that leave us? Sort of 14, 11, 25, 7, 32. So we only have about another seven to spare. Oh, and bearing in mind we've put two in there, so five left. Maybe we'll put a bit in Harper, a point there, plus one to hit and damage, another plus one to hit and damage from that thing, and maybe a point in, in uh, Dex there, something like that. I think that could, that could be okay. One second. I was wondering, uh, I was wondering actually, because purple is at the moment in a, like a rapid fire build, one of these inquisitive builds, just doing a, a ranger life in the background. I thought maybe you might like to have another extra bit of uh, energy resist for a tanky character. But uh, the reason I'm mentioning it is making me wonder what would be... A nice build for red to to end up in we've we've got plenty of viable choices i think we've got this um this pure ranger which he has tried in the past i think he's been he's been pure in the past i could build him like he was at the very start of this series he was capped as a, a multi-class mainly rogue but some ranger and one paladin wasn't it um he could go artificer heavy and use the repeating uh, crossbow one of the benefits to that would be the healing well although his own healing for other people would suck he would have the equivalent of the heal spell as a like a repair spell so he would need very little if any healing from others which would be nice or there's the inquisitive uh, option and you can go loads of different ways with that so maybe in the fullness of time we could do some some other experiments some different types of range builds the one i haven't mentioned which i do plan to show with purple because he doesn't have a rogued life a rogue life a rogue life is the great crossbow one the rogue mechanic so that would be a another possibility so I, th I think we'll uh, we'll use this uh, little series to get some research done see what you folks think of it if you have any uh, comments to uh, to share any any builds you've particularly liked and uh, see where we go with it is uh, the only thing i know is is he's, he's got to be arranged and he's got to be able to do the traps and that's about it um what else have i got noted here not very much actually for 14 no changes in the gear or anything the enhancements i've already mentioned there's no feet or anything so have you got anything to i'm, I'm still <laughs> sitting here staring at these chests have you got anything to add oh um I, spells not really no no well she got a level one paladin spell but honestly oh of course you took it, a <laughs> yeah yeah so it's not even on my bar i just filled it to fill yeah it, so. yeah you're up yeah. to a level, so four paladin levels you have now, don't you? Yeah. Fifteen will be my last paladin level. Right. And the yeah. five Other paladin th levels are so that you can take the tier five in Sacred Defender, aren't they? Yes. I read a comment yes. in the forum uh, recently, something about five paladin, and somebody else replied, oh, we all know why you, you put five paladin. Is it, is it because of that, because of the sacred defense tree? Or is there, is there something else, something a bit uh, overpowered? <laughs> no, I don't think there's anything overpowered. I think it's just so I can get to the fifth core. Yeah. Honestly. So I, I really don't know too much about Paladin. I know they're a strong class because everybody has them as a, their second character, don't they? But uh, 
It's not yeah. something I've ever really uh, gone into in any depth. She's got her second core now in Sacred Defense, so... And yeah, for Sacred Defender, so... That's a that's a toggle, isn't it, that uh, you add yeah, to as you go on. through? Yeah, Yeah, it stays on, so she gets a plus 10 to her PRR and her MRR, and then a plus 150% bonus to her threat gen. So. You have plus 10 PRR and MRR just for having that core? Yes. Oh, nice. Yeah, and then so you, my... you have other things that add to it, don't you? Like, a, is it a saves bonus or... Yeah. Something? Yeah. So, like, her PRR right now is at 103, which isn't bad. I mean, it's much higher. It's over 300 when she's closer to cap. I'll but... let you into a secret. It's double what Red's got, give or take. <laughs> so, yeah, it's not bad. And then she's got quite the fortification going on right now. So, 15, there'll be some changes for her. I mean, obviously, we're going to change her gear and stuff like that. Yeah. Right now, she's still kind of running a little bit of a mosh between Faye and... Um, I Raven guess Moth. I guess Red, oh, Red's all over the place actually. He has uh, he has a Ravenloft set three piece, but then it's uh, it's all over the show. There's a, that's a bit of phase, isn't it? There's some Temple of Evil that's come from. Oh, that's not even a set, is it? That's the Dread Isle. Some slave laws. Yeah, you name it, he's got it. The definition of a mishmash, <laughs> and he's still yep. rocking these uh, these snake uh, gloves for the. Trappy things. Do you want to meet me in the Lord's March Plaza, Roll? Oh, I thought we were going to Ravenloft. Okay. Sorry. We th I thought we said we'd have a go at these um, these level twelves for the for the recording. Ravenloft right folk, of, folk of scene, haven't they? Now, one of these in particular worries me a little bit. The uh, who done it thing. I always seem to go horribly wrong in that. <coughs> I think you you just need some luck in that one, because there are some um, variations of it, you know, depending on who's done it, where you can get very quickly to the right place, finish the quest without even having wandered around, you know, half the area. Conversely, if it's the, you know, the wrong sort of layout, you can end up going for a while. Right, let's give this a go. I think I'm right in saying one of these is the one that drops these Asurial's braces. These excellent uh, healing braces yes. that I am sharing here. And it was Wagon who suggested we uh, get some equipped now. Then what kind of resistance? There's fire, definitely. Fire and electric. <laughs> Actually, in here? Uh, yeah, fire and electric for the bottom. Right. You want jump, you want that. Fire. There's fire on the top as well, isn't there? There's a, an Efri thing. Eh. No, not concerned about that one. Hello, gentlemen. In here. Tidy. Despite all the laggage, I think we did okay there. Yeah, one of one, the one of the blind ones just wandered around randomly, ignoring you and just waiting to be shot. So that was helpful, I would say. I tell you what, while you're doing that, I should be going and. Uh, so oh, what's oh I can't. I was going to say I should be going and sorting out these uh, traps here, but I have to wait for the puzzle. It lagged out, so I only saw four. Crap! Don't worry about it. It happens. Sometimes with me, it... Uh, yeah, it, it just... I only see one of the things. Right, silver dice roll. Go, go. 99. 70. The ground shakes 
Okay, let's get these traps sorted. Thank you. You're welcome. I think there's another... Oh, okay. Not here now. Reaper, though. God, I'm not doing very well with it, am I? Oh, that was poor on my part. Hang on, let's see if we can... 129, that's equally poor. What happened there? That's good. A resonant hum fills the room. Well, don't, my uh, don't forget we were <laughs> flipping it. We were up um, around the 120s with the Cure Serious. Maybe it's because the critical one hasn't had a chance to get souped up yet with all the, the extra levels. Right there. Boo! I have a fear reaper. All the I think souls. I've got one quite a bit of lag here. The souls for you. Thank you. Oh, I gave me three hundred critical heal there. Smoke and ash fill the air as an afridi manifests into the chamber. The oh my God, he got destroyed, didn't he? Good job. Is that why you weren't so worried about him? Never worried when you're with me. So we've got a quite a group coming here, haven't we? Right around this corner. And a plague. It's a lovely intimidate there. Yeah, they're taking a hammering. I wonder, I keep wondering if I shouldn't uh, try the improved precise shot, but I think probably no. Here. Oh my god, was that a strike? Nah. No! Yeah, just one, it's a just spare, one. A spare. Guess what's just coming off cooldown. Hello, gentlemen. Oh, Thank you. another spare. So I think we can say the devastating shot is living up to its name. Oh, my God. Oh, oh. <laughs> Again, just one. I need to improve my aim. Got a Reaper. <clears throat> so I think one thing to be mentioned here about the stance and that shot, that shot's going to take its power off my um, ranged power, isn't it? And the archer's focus is massively boosting the ranged power right now. We've got up to about 25, which is 125 ranged power, you need I think. Do you need the shrine? I think I can manage. Okay, I'm going straight on through then. Oh, what happened there? I pressed the key, but nothing happened. We got a fear reaper in the back, right? We'll see. Behind these guys. Trying to hit it. Not doing very well. That's okay. Oh, you got him turn around. Some more coming, haven't we? Yeah, should be right around here. Oh, strike! <laughs> one over. Oh, you got the ball! Yes. <laughs> oh, I, I cheated. I, I hit the second one with a range. Oh, 
So yeah, I think that's another point, well with this build anyway, another point against using IPS, because although there were situations there that might have uh, favoured it. Come on. I would be really losing on the power side, which would then make my big booms less effective. And as you might have gathered already, I'm quite liking this big boom. Looking forward to seeing what it can do going up the leveling if it if it scales and it should because it's uh, it's just an automatic crit with whatever weapon you've got equipped. I think we could be quite nasty if you just keep rounding them up like that. And the the other thing is, it's going to mean that you're not having to have sustained battering because in the past with red, you know, playing. Playing, playing all the while, there's four or five of them around the tank, isn't there? Sort of nibbling away, and it begins to add up. Is this the Who Done It quest? Oh, it is. Okay. Moment of truth, people. <laughs> Let's go in with some belief and just watch it gradually fritter away. <clears throat> or it could go absolutely like clockwork and we'd be just amazed at the outcome I've given you acid, fire and electric You learn that the levitating stone, known as the Eye of Serania, oh. the artifact you were sent to Was that? Find, Who was I following? Oh, I was I was following an NPC. I thought it was you. Your employer suspects that this is an inside job. It's up to you to find uh, the Right, there's somebody sometimes round here, isn't there? But we don't go yeah. down here. Okay, no. Nope. Wait, you don't want to go down nope. the cobalt? No. Nope. I got oh. shown one of the... Um, Folk who uh, sometimes follows the videos, Crow Feeder, I think he's called, was kind enough to show me around the uh, around this map. Can you do that? I'm gonna pick up some. Oh, there's a fight here. This cultist hood is just big enough for a half orc head. And look, there's a single hair in it. One that matches Bernadotte. Trying to get a middle one. That's Fear like Reaper. It. Oh. I was so busy trying to get the center one, I didn't notice. So do we have any... We don't have any... Any clues or anything so far, do we? I picked up a clue. Oh, did you? Nice one. I'm going to find the other ones. I've lost you now. I'm in the center, like in the actual center center here. Oh, I found, there's, there's, I think there's two here. Caleb and, and. The conversation with a workers union member casts doubt on okay. Bernadotte's interest in helping the workers. I'm going to do What about this, um, made her fortune as a this area here, this cemetery? I've got a ledger. Hold on. A conveniently specific set of skills. The worker's testimony reveals that only Danis going to be brave. Knew how to Don't go in that cemetery. Are you in there? The I mean uh, I'm hiding. shows that Danis has been skimming funds from the construction project. Instead of tools, he's been buying arms and armor for his crew, whoever they are. Why does he need an army? That was poor on my part. Now, did we find any clues in here? Anything? No? Oh. 
Okay, so did you check up all, all the top area here in the middle? That's where I was working on, and oh, then right. you said I went to no, the go cemetery. No, <laughs> you, you carry on. You carry on. Hey, there's the snitch. You already I, talked I, to I him? Got, I talked to those two. So you okay. you went uh, up to the top here. Let's see if there's anybody down here. No, no, no. That's Bernadotte. Uh, right, I've got a, a pamphlet. Oh, we can accuse Bernadotte now, can we, with one? And she's right next yep. to me, just dropping down the... Um, where are you? Just dropping down the hole in the middle where... where I'm like, she's she's where? right next to me. Just drop down the you're, okay. you're there. Remains to be seen. There are cobalt footprints all over this place. They're up to something, and that suggests no, nope. we no, not oh. fighting. Oh, yeah, we are. Behind you. Nice job. Right, now this is where I fall down with the Bernadotte thing. She... The, the door is... Somewhere... Do we have to search for it? I think there's a secret door somewhere here. It's right here. Where did you go? Well, there's a door right here. I just went... Yeah, um, no, no, no. No, this is no. kobolds. It's, it's up. So, or is it through here? There's a secret door somewhere we have to find. Another guy behind you. Oh, crud. No, I think he's back up towards where she was. There's, there's something. Is it here? Here. This looks good. Hold on, I'm coming. I've sniffed it out. Hello, gentlemen. So we, I think we can see it's certainly not like the sorcerer's fireball, but it's still damn effective. And considering it's not using any mana and it's completely sustainable, it's uh, it's not bad at all. This devastating thing, and unlike the sorcerer fireball, the eye. it scales up with the, the level and the weapon, so that's happy days. And so is that. That was pretty painless, wasn't it, for the uh, Who Done It quest? Well done, team. Happy days. And there can be some nice, especially for casters, there can be some nice uh, sticks in, in these, can't there? Mm -hmm. I'm carrying one right now. Uh -huh. Is it going to drop the chest? What's going on here? Oh, there we go. Yeah, you have to listen to all the... La, 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 la. Oh, there we go. What's that? Fusible Scepter of Magnetism. You want that? Um, I'll swap you. If you're going to do a Mechanoman, I sent you something. What is it? Uh, repair. Oh, it's not terrible. Okay. Happy days. Oh, we've got some thieves tools in there too. Nice one. Good stuff. That could be one for when you level the cat, the storm singer. Uh, she has, I think she has it, but I have another one that does not, so. And if nothing else, it had a rubber thing on so you can chew it, can't you? <clears throat> My boys were singing the song of their people. <laughs> you wait until this weekend when those chickens arrive and then see what they're doing. Hmm. Actually, these, these resist energies, especially considering I don't have evasion on this build, it could be really useful. 
The Eye of Erie is reported to be somewhere within this network of twisting desert canyons. Now, the hunt for the artifact truly begins. Strike! Strike! <laughs> <laughs> I cheated, I boosted before. Doesn't matter, you still strike. Something glinting oh god, there's a plague in that corner. Yeah, I've got him now. It was a hell of an effort with the AoE though. Didn't quite get the plague. He's never gonna go in in one shot, is he? I picked up the crest. Nice. Ah, oh, there we go. Uh, nope. Turned around, the sunlight was in my eyeballs. <laughs> Had to shut my window. I'm like, ooh, can't see. Strike! <laughs> 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 Okay. Oh, talking of sunlight, which way? Which way are you going? If you, are you going up? There's a crest up there. Up, up the ladder. Go on, then you go yeah. and fetch it. I'll go on. For those of you not familiar with this quest, the crests are well, they're, they're in set places, but there are several different places I, th I think most of them can be the first one I think is always in the same place but apart from that the laugh like hoots of hyenas come from the tunnel ahead oh, oh that was really poor wasn't it left half of them wasn't that bad there can be a crest in here on the it side, not there this time. Okay, let's mark this one. Then the pool turns as an elemental flows up and attacks. Nice job. The elemental dissipates and the magical barrier protects. And the last the crest could be down I got the here. crest. Nice one. So the last one could be down here with these uh, I think there's more scorpions and things in scorpions. here. Oh, yes, it is down here, by the way. Oh, and a plague reaper. Look at that. He was the only one I didn't catch in the big... Uh... Uh, that's that's not, not, uh, not great. Eh. Tis fine, tis fine. Did that? No, it didn't. It try the bottle tried to kill around the corner to you, but uh, no good. I think that one's going to get the... Uh, you know what to do, don't you? Put them in and just do one, two, three, four. Two. Two now. Sometimes it wants number two as well. Just like the uh, dragon while. demigod uh, puzzle, yeah. The strange feeling that the path has just become open to you. Oh, what happened there? Apart I can't from, intimidate a construct. Yeah, I, I, I wasn't hitting it. I don't know quite what happened there. Which is funny, because I can intimidate the construct dogs, which makes no sense to me. Mm -hmm. uh, Carnage Reaper to the right. I don't know if you can see it. It's by the yes, rock. I see. So once the initial blast has gone in, you take very little damage from them. I'm seeing that, which is nice. Oh, got a bottle on the ceiling. That's one of the hazards. Da -na 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 -na. Da -dun -dun -dun. 
As you step inside the temple. Ready for the globies? Yeah. Two more around here, aren't there? Yeah. But they're intimidatable, so that's okay. Oh, that's good. You hear the sound of heavy Just back them up Hello, into the middle. Man. Make a big group Come of them on, all, boys. if you can. Oh, that was good. Nice one. I'm failing Hello. miserably with these bottles. Ah, don't worry about it. Just kill whatever's Every coming at me. Every time I try it, uh, you've turned a corner or something. Yeah, so... Right, let's find myself a little vantage point here. This place relied upon Remember to mark the target. Eyes. Put the that sneaky thing on here. Lost. Very well. If you would be the one to bear it to safety, then prove your worth. The Deva Happy days. The nod. You are indeed worthy. This charge is now yours to bear. Do not let it fall into darkness. We will be watching. You wonder about the Deva's parting words as you place the Eye of Erion in your path. I, I don't know how far it goes up, all, but I think your... I'm pretty sure your prayer gets stronger and stronger up to a point as you go up. Mm -hmm. I got the tower shield. <clears throat> yeah. You found a tower shield. Yeah, I got oh, the nice one. Just Tower Shield. You're um, you don't have the proficiency yet, do you? But it might be something she might like to use. That's that's all she uses is Tower Shields. But you don't have the Tower Shield proficiency, do you? At the moment, does it matter? No, but she no, because she doesn't really cast anything. <laughs> all right. She's not a caster, so. Well, I think the proficiency affects what uh, what you get from it, like the PR and and all that kind of stuff. I do not like this one. I've noticed since playing this game, I'm a very linear person. I don't like the jumping around stuff. And yet you didn't mind too much the, uh, you know, on the... Um... You yawn. A slight fog in the corners of your vision. Uh, the, those souped up, uh, at cap quests, you know, the... Uh, Illithid invasion ones. You quite liked the jumpy jumpy one there, and it was me who found it difficult. I'm gonna collect all the animals. <laughs> okay. Wait, where'd you go? Don't lose me, because as we noted in yesterday's episode, where'd you go? I don't know, just find me! <laughs> I'll have to, I still don't know where. It made for a laughable thing. I still don't know where you went. Oh, I trod on the wrong piece there. Hang on. I'm just standing in the middle. Ooh, a kitty. Still treading on the wrong piece. Hang on. Still wrong. Uh, are you sure it's not that one? I think it's that no, it's one me. and this one. You no. still have a corner down there. Oh! What happened here? You instinctively oh, okay. As the last now, if I had to guess, maybe somebody trod on the puzzle. First, you feel a I mean, I'm not going to say I didn't. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, one second. You have passed the ritual as I had hoped. Come now, pilgrim, and pray before the altar. You blink away. You realize with a jolt that you must have been asleep this entire time. Mother Ashira has vanished, but somehow you still hear her voice resonate through the chamber.
I daren't open this door on my own because I know all the stuff comes and uh, I'm not convinced Red would survive it. Shall we be brave? We'll be brave. I think it takes a little while to come anyway, doesn't oh, it? You're awake already? I had hoped my hypnosis would have a more lasting effect. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised. You did resist my initial compulsion to send you away after all. Oh God. I suppose you won't just leave Of course, as a reaper, why wouldn't there be? There's no reason to lie anymore. I am what you see. She's, she's not even here and she's tanking. <laughs> <laughs> the magic I have used to think there's still something out there, yeah. Has kept me fed for all these years. Oh, stone guard. Now these stone guard, they just seem disproportionately tough compared to the rest of them. I've seen on the, uh, you know, on the damage line, Really often, just zero basic damage You're for me to reach the Twilight Chapel. against those things. Able to save the monks. Or you might sink into a distress <coughs> sleep. God, now this is going to be a problem, isn't it? Feather fall. Door gives way. You plunge down into a shaft. Okay. With the Let's try and get. Sorry. It's all right. Sorry, sorry. sorry. Just make I'm your coming. way back up. You, you're going to be going into. Oh God, there's a fear reaper in here somewhere. I'm coming. You're going to be going into the, um, you know, the room where you have to do all the jumpy jumpy. Your favourite. Uh, yeah, I'm coming. God knows this anvil likes to jump. I did give you a jump at the start, I'm sure. Yeah, I got it, I have it. Do I need to go down there or should I just stay up here? I think if if um, if you're able to jump up, jump up, but I had no choice but to go down. Yeah, I'm up here, I'm up top here. And that's a bit of a blessing, isn't it? So anybody who comes afterwards can... Uh, Avoid having to negotiate all that stuff. Oh, the infamous ladder bug. <laughs> right, the sting's immediately on the other side there, so get yourself ready. Not the best there, although we did get one or two blindings. Are oh, they there's, considered... There's quite no, a lot of not. lag as well there, isn't there? After the quarry vanished, <coughs> you notice <coughs> I think there's a parrot or something on the way back here. Is there a, there's something sat there? Look, Misty, the monastery kitty. cat. Another kitty over here. Pet all so the animals. There's seven animals in total. That's why No, I there's don't... more. There's more than seven. Well, it's saying there's seven remain. Left. Yeah. So uh, I think you'd be I... lucky to, to get them all. I always miss one. If you manage to, there's a parrot there. Oh, there's two, actually. There's a chime. Two parrots. If you even I get if you get that one. down to one, I'll be impressed. So that suggests that most of them are on the way round. Then these optional animals. I've got things coming here.
more things up at the top. Da, 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 da. Immediately as you go in, they'll be on you. Oh, yes. That's more like it. That is more like it. You can clearly see the courtyard below, as well as two other doors on this level. Oh, little uh, cat, go on, I'll do it. Oh, there's another one right there. Oh, I've made a mistake here, haven't I? Okay. Ooh. Do you want to just go over to the door where the crests are all? Okay. I'll sort the crests out. So for this one... Ah! Oh, no! Yep. When you touch the water... Is she sex? Which way do I go? This way again? Weightless. I, the, you, you need to find your way back to the climbing... Um, you know, the wall that we figure climbed up. I'll figure it out. <clears throat> so all I'm doing here is trying to avoid the fight in that room. If we... Uh, uh, manipulate the reality here we can pick up the other crest so what I should have done was go straight in here without going on the altar and then so I could came, have had this we came in this way and we went across that way that's what we did okay I'm going this way and then we this way that way and now I need to go went. back again don't I Preferably without falling. Just look for that little side door that leads you onto the yeah. climbing up the wall thing. Yeah, I think I'm getting closer here. I'm at it. I'm at the climbing wall. Great stuff. So you'll not be far away. I'm just putting the things in the sockets here. I think that's probably the the most challenging. I found your parrot. Yeah, touch it. I did. Uh, oh, I have to touch this altar. Yeah, yeah. So get to Thank the main you. room. Go through the door that uh, yeah, that we with put the, crest the crests in. in, and you're almost there. You found your way to a corridor overlooking the Twilight Chapel. Yet you oh, cannot Lord simply Lord drop Dark. down. The room is blocked by a magic barrier. Alas, so near and yet so far. If you keep, ever uh, once you're through you there, keep following the, the altars round yeah. and you'll get to the puzzle room where I am. The eye's voice fades, and the vines blocking your path forward disappear. <laughs> so, this is what you chose? Very interesting. Let's see how you fare. The last tile turns into position. I think I can see you. Hang on there, Alt. Uh, you're just on the wrong... Oh, no. No, perfect. No. You're on the right side. So we do this one again. And we go to the end. Did we get any of the animals that were in here? Uh, I didn't. It says there are two left. I think that's already a pretty good effort. Mm. Usually I can get it to one. You drop down into the Twilight Chapel. I'm coming down. Mother Ashira's dusty, desiccated corpse lies okay. to the eye of the Now I'm going this The question way. would be, is it always the same one I that you're missing? Oh, I think so. <coughs> 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 
they kept me you down at the bottom? Yep. When in fact, I had been the one containing them <laughs> inside a calm illusion. And yet, you still wish to shake them away? You've seen I wasn't sure at first idea. about this pack. There were only it two of them I did regularly. But uh, I worked this one in gradually. And then um, a kind soul from the channel um, guided me round the Who Done It quest. And since then, I've been a bit better with it. But you're still kind of reliant on what it what it throws your way, aren't you? If it's not the first one, and you end up having to mess about. Uh, they're, they're active all. There's a reaper, carnage reaper, fear reaper, fear reaper. Yeah, take the fear. Carnage is in front of me. Just chilling. Now I'm managing not to move here, so that's helpful. <laughs> nice one. To slay the last Happy days. Has for you. Yeah, once we start getting up to the high archer's focus, things away. begin to uh, suffer. I have no more and that's another difference Despite between the uh, between the um, I suppose my machine gun inquisitive type build that only get to go up to 15 and the, the pure bow ones For the moment, don't forget to take your chest I won't to break the spell and cure these monks of their peaceful sleep. Well, all in all, I thought that went pretty well. No obvious disasters. I suppose falling down off the thing, that's, that's only a mini disaster. We recovered it, didn't we? <laughs> that's probably on a par with me getting lost in the uh, Ravenloft one. I'd have been shocked if I hadn't have fallen off on this character, honestly. <laughs> yeah, I think we'll consider that uh, a pretty decent success, that one. And we even found uh, a little uh, scepter or something in there for you. So, yeah, I'll take that. Okay, I think that about wraps it up for this one. Thank you very much, as always, for looking. And we will speak to you next time. Take care.